scared this guy. You know, I'm not honestly surprised. You know what? You give the guy a million dollars, he's not here. It's typical Mr. Gumbo, though. Remember the test production? Oh, unbelievable. Right? Just like, about the soil? Everything he does. It's crap. You have got to be kidding me about that. You thought you, you thoroughly enjoyed the soil? No, no, no I, I agree with you guys. I just like it. Shut happening. up! I'll tell you right now, every plot, every script has been straight crap. Okay? Kid's always got a vision, thinks he's doing something good, but there's no vision. He can't even see out of those eyes. You know, that's funny you say that, because have you actually ever looked in his eyes? Hi, gentlemen. I'm, I'm really, really, I'm really, I'm really sorry that I'm like, I'm, re I'm, I'm so sorry. I'm picking, thank you. I'm, I'm really, really sorry, really sorry. Yeah, I'll pass. I'm really sorry. Pleasure. Mr. Gumbo, can I give you a piece of advice? When you're going to come here, you do not show up late, okay? You understand that? I'm very sorry, but it is well worth the million dollars. Mr. Bernstein pays people big money, and you do not show up late. But this film is way worth a hey. million dollars. Ready? Look, wait, 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 hey, wait. wait. It's not like we're giving you pennies here. It's a million dollars out of my pocket, all right? You're about to see the preview right now. We're talking about a million dollars. This better be a million dollar production. This thing better be the next Godfather. Light Water Trees and Bob Half man, half hobo, half animal, never before seen by mankind. The hobo sapien looks for food. On this day, he finds one of his tastiest treats. A Slim Jim. Bob tries to mate with other species. Today, it's geese. After failing, he searches for food. Wild tree shrooms are his favourite treat, filled with nutrients. Unfortunately for Bob, it was a bad batch of tree shrooms. The scent of trace rooms is too alluring. He must go back for seconds. Bob collects various treasures from the surrounding area, which he always brings back to his den. What a pleasant surprise. It looks like we've caught him sleeping. Ooh. It seems like we've stopped again. Walsh is the innocent bystander and knowingly wanders into Bob's den. Nigel, my dad. I make myself a little comfortable here. So, gentlemen, let's talk bills. 